Yeah, we're still covering the damage from out of Wilmington, North Carolina, and it's extended to here on the Gulf Coast from the East Coast. And I'm joined this morning with Kathy and John Muzzy, and they're from Wilmington, North Carolina, but they have a home here in Pass Christian. They say so they've been monitoring and watching everything that they've been seeing from flooding to wind damage to everything else back home. So what's that been like for you guys? Oh, it's been awful. It's been awful. It's, you know, it's broken our hearts. We're just devastated about what's happened in Wilmington. Um, but we're so glad we're able to get such great coverage here. Just watching it streaming on WECT and seeing uh, what's going on in Wilmington and not being there has been very hard. Uh, we're fortunate to be here to have a home on, in, on the Gulf Coast, but it, it's survivor's guilt almost mm -hmm. to, to be this far away. Uh, and we're, we're going to be very fortunate to get back as soon as we can. They've just opened up I-40, so we'll get back as soon as we can. As we can. You said you're fortunate to get back, but you're, you also told me that you're fortunate because your home didn't sustain as much damage as we've seen in other parts of of uh, the Wilmington area, is that right? That's correct. Uh, our our neighborhood mostly stayed. We were uh, we were fortunate to have a place to come to, so we evacuated. Uh, Kathy, being a native New Orleans, uh, was had seen what Katrina did. I have seen what Katrina did here, and we decided we should get out. Uh, most of our neighborhood stayed, and we've been in constant contact with them. Uh, which has been comforting, uh, uh, seeing all of our neighbors help each other. Uh, we were able to open up our house when we got power back and our generator and uh, lo loaned out to several people in the neighborhood. But uh, it, uh, it's a long road, I think, yet. It's not the same as being there, and so we, we can't wait to get home because we've seen all the destruction. It's been so hard, and we want to be able to volunteer and give back. So my friends are getting things together and telling us what we can do so we can get out there and help. Um, that, that's one of the good things that comes out of a storm is people working together and helping each other and, and making things come back to normal. Well, guys, Kathy and John are planning to get back to Wilmington as soon as possible um, to start surveying the damage and helping other people in need. So you see that recovery work is just beginning, and it's not going to be over for quite some time. Reporting in past Christian, Ray Price, WLOX News Now.